Five Unusual People in the World, Part 98. Hello, you guys. I'm Kisha, and wish you all a new day full of energy. Being born with different characteristics will sometimes make someone feel miserable. A few people have that bad thing when suffering from rare diseases. Without the internet, I bet you wouldn't even know that they do exist. Are you ready? Let's begin. Number five, Tariq. The boy Tariq from Uttar Pradesh state, India, has giant arms of up to 12 inches. According to his family, right from birth, he has had big hands. As he starts to grow, the hands get bigger. When his father was alive, he took Tariq to the local doctor's a lot. But his father has passed away, and now only his mother is left, so he can't run for treatment. The poor boy is stuck in his own life. He can't even change his clothes, take a shower, or do simple activities on his own. Tariq is taken care of by his brother Harvin, who helps him with simple daily tasks. Even when he wanted to go to school, the school refused because he couldn't hold a pen. Previously, the father took the boy to the local doctors, but when he died, the mother did not have enough money to treat her son. In the village, he is considered a demon. They believe that he has a curse, so most people avoid him. Doctors suspect that he most likely has elephantiasis, with the scientific name apodoconiosis. People with this disease will have excessive swelling in the layers of tissue, but the disease is usually caused by a parasite that lives in mosquitoes. And Terry was born with such feet from birth. Number four, Janet Silva. Janet Silva, a young girl born in 2005 in Gambia, West Africa, can't eat, talk, or laugh. There was a giant tumor with the size of a grapefruit growing on her jaw that made her unable to even close her mouth. It also made her from a beautiful girl to ugly. How beautiful she is! The girl's mother said that her daughter's problem started when she was nine years old, an age where children are still very innocent. But the little girl has had to endure the pain that even adults don't want to have. Although the doctors diagnosed it as a benign tumor, they decided not to operate on her as the medical condition could not be accommodated. In three years, Janet's tumor had tripled the size of her lower jaw and left her face disfigured. About the size of a grapefruit, according to the doctors, the tumor weighs six pounds, making her unable to eat. And if it persisted for another six months, she would die from lack of food. To perform this expensive and dangerous surgery, an NGO paid all of the cost and forced Janet to go to New York because in Gambia, her country of origin, there were not enough facilities. Specialist doctors intervened in a sophisticated surgery to remove the tumor and rebuild her mouth. The surgeons revealed that the recovery from the surgery went smoothly, and Janet was finally able to return home. When it comes to pregnancy, many people would think of young girls with their husbands. It's the sweetest thing couples do for each other. But if someone mentioned a child, would you believe it? Number three, Nisha. Baby Nisha, living in the state of Tamil Nadu, India, is a very beautiful girl with a belly bigger than any other child. Nisha's mother, Sumathi, and her father, Raju, did not know how serious her condition was. She was only taken to the hospital by her parents after they panicked. Their daughter's belly was abnormally swollen, unlike a normal fat child. Nisha's parents said, at first, their little angel refused to eat, didn't gain weight for a long time. Had trouble breathing and had an abnormally large belly. This was extremely dangerous, but it was only after her belly had grown to a significantly abnormal size that her parents went to see a private doctor in a road. After an ultrasound, the surgeon thought it was just a large cyst that took up the entire abdomen, which moved her internal organs to the right corner of the stomach cavity. However, he later found out that. Nisha's condition was actually fetus within pregnancy. This is an extremely rare condition in which a twin fetus is parasitic in the body of a sibling. The surgery then took place successfully in two hours. All of Nisha's internal organs have also been put in place. 
largest removed from Nisha, a fetus weighing 7.7 pounds, equivalent to the weight of a newborn baby. Usually, this rare condition occurs in only 1 in 10 million births. Any woman is very happy to be a mother, but an evil disease took that ability from this poor girl. Number 2. Marilyn Felipe Marilyn Felipe, born in 1980, living in Philippines, is a very beautiful girl. Everyone who saw her congratulated her on her pregnancy. In fact, these congratulations hurt her a lot, because the truth about Marilyn Felipe and her pregnant belly is further than expected. Years after her marriage, and when she saw her belly grow every day, she felt like she had two or three twins, but she was completely wrong. There was no baby in her belly, and it was just a tumor. Felipe was heartbroken when doctors informed her that the bump was actually a myoma tumor on her cervix. The tumor had a very bad and negative effect on the uterus. She may no longer be able to bear children. Sadly, she is often stopped on the street by people unaware of her condition who give their best wishes for what they think is pregnancy. The doctors said they could remove it with surgery. However, the cost is $2,000. Felipe did not have much money and could not save much money by farming. Although she tried her best, the years began to pass. Meanwhile, her belly continued to swell and her condition worsened. Doctors from a local hospital in Slovakia performed an operation to remove a tumor weighing the equivalent of a large stone on this man's face. Who is he? Let's find out with me. Number 1. Stefan Zolik Stefan Zolik, from Slovakia, has an unusually large neck that scares anyone who comes across him. This is actually a tumor. As a retired plumber, Stefan felt miserable as he had to lock himself in the apartment. Every time he walked on the street, the tumor stretched on both sides of his ears, causing Stefan to receive a lot of scrutiny from others. According to the doctors, this tumor is a rare form of the disease, scientifically named Madeline. Initially, the lipoma was quite small but grew thicker and thicker around the patient's neck. For a long time, he wanted to take off this burden, but the doctor was worried that it would cause adverse complications. After careful consideration, Stefan was allowed to undergo surgery to get a new look. The surgery lasted for 5 hours and was a great success. Even family members are surprised at the change of their loved one. Perhaps the most excited person is Stefan. He gets excited at the thought of being able to comfortably go out on the street and drink beer with friends. Although delighted with the result achieved, Igor Hamola, the doctor in charge of the surgery said, This is an extremely rare form of disease. Despite surgery, the tumor can't be completely removed and it can come back at any time. Now, the world medicine has been very developed. Hope that one day, the talented doctors in the world can help everyone have a normal life. Thank you for watching the video. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and turn on the notification bell to watch more interesting videos. And now, goodbye and see you again.